Holly dog, y'all. If this is your first time here, yes. If this is your first time here, welcome to the channel, all right? Around here, we make it funky sometimes. We make it sassy sometimes. But all the time, we keep it classy, okay? We're going to keep it classy all the time. All right, and to the returning dolls and just what's up? I'm glad to have you all back. All right, we are doing 12, 12 sleighs of Christmas. 12 sleighs of Christmas. Yes, 12 sleighs of Christmas. Yes. So this is the third sleigh. All right, sleigh number three, baby. Okay, so we're going to do something a little fun, a little colorful, just a, just, just a little color, you know, not nothing so neutral today. We're going to bring a little color, okay? So that that's normally like a little, one of my little funky looks, okay? Yeah. Mm -hmm. When I bring a little color, normally it's funky, okay? All right, so uh, we're going to jump into it. Ain't no need to just lollygag. Y'all know 12 slays of Christmas. I'm here to bring it, whether it be for your Christmas party, your ugly Christmas party, um, your gala, your banquet, dinner, just whatever, you know, just whatever, <laughs> just whatever, okay? So, today we're going to use the Queen Palette, Fumi Times Juvia's, this beauty right here. And y'all know, it's, it's, see, you see, it's color in here. It's color in here. This purple, this red, this pink, That's that screams color to me. So that screams a funky look to me, okay? So that's what we're going to do today. All right, so I'm going to need you all to make sure you got you something to snack on. So pause the video. Get you some popcorns, some chips, some pretzels, just whatever it is. Or grab your dinner. Or your breakfast or your lunch, just whatever, and a beverage of your choice. And let's jump in to this look. So, fasten your seat belts. I'm gonna show y'all how I will be down.
All right, so I did the other eye off camera. And what we're going to do is talk about it. Talk about what we did, the colors that we use. If this is your first time here, this is what I always do when I don't talk while I'm doing the eyes, okay? All right, so I packed all of this beautiful red. It's called Ola, okay? That's Fumi's husband. That's his name. And maybe red is because she loves him so much, okay? Maybe that red is for love. But I packed that all over the lid. And I kind of went up in my crease a bit so that I can actually see the fade of the colors. When I popped on the purple, which is Adrian, that's her baby boy. And I tapped it out to soften up and blend out the harsh line of the red. Then I came back with sister to sister this beautiful peachy pale peachy color and i softened out the edges of the purple with sister to sister and that is kind of like her talk show type of thing where she's talking to her to, to sisters um not her biological sisters but sisters like women okay and um I use that and I kind of put it on my brow bone a bit but what I think I'm going to do is change that up a little bit. I'm going to change that up a little bit. And as I'm looking and doing my eyebrows, I was trying to make my brows smaller. Try not to have my arch up so high. But when I come back, these brows, just so y'all know, because y'all going to be like, her brows wasn't looking like that first. But I'm going to take that arch up just a little bit higher. You know, they're just a little bit too thin. That, that arch is not up enough. That is the one good thing about brows, you can play with them. You can manipulate them. You can make the arch as high as you want it to go, okay? But just don't have it up there to your hairline now. You're going to be looking surprised. <laughs> you don't want to look surprised, right? Okay. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put... FDV approved this beautiful shimmer on my brow bone. That's what I'm gonna do now. And that's what she normally says when she's doing a review on a particular product. Is it FDV approved? Or like she says, or like, is this is it FDV approved? Or maybe he says it. Says it. However, yeah, that's what she wants to know. Is it FDV? Her initials, is it approved? You know how they say the FDA, but she says FDV. I think that's a unique twist. Everybody needs to have that unique standout twist on their channel, okay? Just a tad bit, because that is actually quite bright. So I got to blend that in, y'all. I got to. I got to make sure she in there because that's kind of bright. And I'm going to take that brush that I added sister to sister with and just soften that out because I don't want it to be just sitting there. Now. You don't want that brow bone highlight to just be sitting there. You put it there, but I think I took a little too. There we go. Now, I'm going to go back and soften it up with that brush. Yeah. I'm not feeling my brows right now. I'm going to fix them up. Something missing from them. I'm not sure what, but I'm not feeling them. But anywho, nevertheless, I'm going to clean this face off, okay? Because I got a lot of red fallout on my face. Yeah. A lot. So I'm going to get it cleaned. I'm going to come back with probably the finished yeah. Probably the finished look. Yeah. So I'll be back. Y'all keep on watching so you can see what this turns out to be. This is day, this is uh, slay number three, baby. Slay number three on its way. All right. Keep on. All watching. right. Hey, tell me what you think. Tell me what you think. Tell me what you think. This is <laughs> my third sleigh of the 12 sleighs of Christmas. 
And what we're gonna do is add one more color out this palette. Yes, I like to try to use as many as possible when I can. And so I'm going to use one more color. All right, so um, we're gonna use Glam right here. This beautiful color right here is such a pretty color. I think I used this color maybe twice having this palette. But yeah, that's what we're gonna use. We're gonna we're gonna kick it up one more notch. We're gonna take it up a little bit higher, just a little bit higher, okay? And I'm gonna pop that right there in the inner tear duct. Get me a very small detail brush. Tap off the excess. I don't want anything falling on this beat, okay? And we're gonna pop that right in the tear duct, just to add, just to open it up a little bit. Add a little shimmer, like so. Yep. I added me some black in my waterline. I want to open it up now. Yeah. Let's make that color do what it do, baby. focus and focus and when you add these colors into your tear duct blend it in don't just sit it there blend it in just a little pop okay just a little tiny pop that's a beautiful color y'all it's really pretty on the lids you won't be able to get your hands on this palette if you wanted to because this was I guess a limited edition Sometimes those collaborations that Julia do, you know, she don't let you get it again. You just got to get it when you can get it, when it come out. And I ain't mad at it. Sometimes I try to make sure I get that collab. Because you don't know if she going to bring that palette back or not. Or that lippy. Because two lippies came with this, because but because but because this is twelve slays of Christmas. I wanted to pop me some red on my lips, and what I used was the Wet and Wild lippy. It's a the liquid cat suit in ninety three no no nine thirty B Missy and Fierce. You see her. Yeah, so y'all tell me what you think in the comments and let me know what you think about this look. Chat it up down there. Yep, yeah, uh-huh. Tell me what you think. And give me a big old thumbs up if you like this video, okay? If you like this look, you agree with this look, you might want to try to achieve. No, not try. You're you, you going to achieve this look. You're going to go after this look and juice it up yourself a little bit. Or, hey, just recreate the look, baby. Okay, you don't have to use this palette if you don't have this palette. You can always substitute with other things. If you don't have a bright red um, eyeshadow, I suggest, listen, get you a liquid lipstick and put it all over and then get what you have that's the very closest to this red color and put it on your lids or you can find a red blush a you know a real dark burgundy blush put that all over the lid you, i know you got a purple and i know you got this kind of peachy tan color because th those are familiar it may not be the same pigmentation baby but guess what i know you can find a color okay all right i want to thank you all for tuning in today tonight this morning whenever you tuned in okay and i will catch you all in the next slay. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.